Hi, I'm Rita Peterson with Everything Homemade. Today, I am going to show you how to make delicious roasted sweet potato. Hi, I'm Rita Peterson with Everything Homemade. And these are my helpers today. This is Grace, she's four years old, and Annika, who is two. We are going to make one of our favorite recipes, roasted sweet potato. I've already cut up one here. Um, so we're going to do this one here. So what I've done was, uh, first of all, grab two knife. sweet potato. Yeah, it's mom's knife. And you want to cut off the Mom. ends. Because the ends, knife. a lot of times, have some mold can have on them. So you want to get rid of them. And you want a nice, firm, sweet potato. You shouldn't, you notice I can't squish it. It shouldn't be soft. So what you want to do is, I like chopping it in... Um, portions here in little circles and sweet potato a good yeah. sweet potato is a little bit tough yeah. yeah right away munchkin you can help mom right away okay so I get it cut up here I'm just gonna put those to the side and then I'm going to cube it and if you have children this is a good time for them to help because they can put it in the lasagna dish as you go. So this is how I include my kids in cooking in the kitchen um, with me. Just make sure that you do not get their hands under your knife. Um, put it in the put it in the lasagna dish, Annika. They need to learn that they can grab when the sweet potato is away from where you're cook, where you're um, cutting, that way their little fingers won't get cut. So safety first when it comes to cooking with children. So we'll just get these cubed here, and I like them all different sizes because um, some of us like them crispier. Um, younger kids like them softer; they're easier to eat. So I just make them in. Um, lots of different sizes for all my kids in different ages. We're almost done here. <laughs> okay, get you some more here. Want those ones? Okay, the last one here. Now you can see, be careful, you can see how full this lasagna dish is. That's just fine. The bottoms will uh, almost, no, almost caramelize as you go. And the tops will stay a little bit softer, which is just perfect. So now you've got a lasagna dish full of um, sweet potato. You could split this into two without, without any problem at all. Okay, now we just wait. I'm just going to get my knife out of the way. So now we're going to season these. What I'd like to start with is some olive oil. So we'll grab some olive oil here. No. And, and we pour it over. Yeah. Whoa. And we, and we just, we give it a good coating over, over it. Don't be, no, don't be skimpy on the olive oil. Then what I like, now you can season these. Yeah. No, no, let mommy please. You can season these how you like it. Hold that for a second. Okay, I like this is marjoram. Um, I like it on here, so I'm going to sprinkle a good tablespoon on top or a little bit more on top here. And then I like a little bit of basil. I just sprinkle it over more or less. I mean you can mix other other herbs. You can put put some um, rosemary on it if you want. You put oregano. We're gonna give it give it some salt and don't be scared to add some salt. Salt adds flavor. Get a healthy salt with lots of minerals in it. It'll be good. 
It's always a challenge cooking with kids. They want to do everything for you. Get some pepper on there and then let her go to the pepper. Okay, so that's my basic. I like them I like them with herbs on it. Um, you can make these hot yum. You can add some some hot peppers to them. You can put some garlic, chop up garlic, whatever your family likes. Um, as she's trying to use the, the pepper shaker here. Then what you want to do is grab a couple spoons and you want to mix it up because you want it to evenly distribute all the herbs. And once in a while one jumps off um, evenly get it distributed. Make sure the oil coats them all. Beautiful. Then you got it looking like this. And it's ready to go in the oven. So I cook these at 350 for two hours um, in, the, in the oven. I may toss it up once if you forget, no big deal. Sometimes I forget just with the busy household here with five kids. Um, put it in the oven, 350 for two hours and you will have delicious sweet potato. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video and thank you for watching. Please subscribe to my channel, Everything Homemade, and comment. I'd love to hear from you. Everything, Everything homemade. homemade.